Despite speculation about a potential trade, the Lions ultimately held on to their third overall pick in the NFL draft, taking Ohio State's Jeff Okuda. 7 Action Sports anchor Brad Galley got a chance to speak with the newest member of the Lions this afternoon and joins us now with more. Brad? This is usually a day where the Lions parade out their first round pick with a jersey, a hat, and they take pictures for about 10 minutes. Obviously, with the circumstances in our world, we had to meet Jeff Okuda in a different way through a Zoom conference call. The Lions did not make a trade. Bob Quinn said there was no firm offer at number three, so they stayed and drafted a player to help what was one of the league's worst defenses last year. The Zoom call, staying at home, being drafted from his basement, it didn't take away from the emotion of the night. On draft night, there's the build-up to the moment. I'll start right now, really. For Jeff Okuda, he knew the draft started after the locked-in top two picks. With his family and a portrait of his late mother at his side, Okuda's phone rang. Bob Quinn was on the other end. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Bob Quinn from the Detroit Lions. Okuda entered Ohio State in 2017. Weeks into his time in Columbus, his mother lost her battle with leukemia. Okuda says he plays for her. In the draft moment, it's because of her. While she's doing chemotherapy, she was still in a nursing school. And just seeing that, um, it just instilled a work ethic, just knowing that, um, you know, what you put into things. Jeff, welcome to the Lions. We just made you the third overall pick in the draft. Once the official business is over, the emotion and eruption. Lions. You know, I'll say it's not often that you meet someone and you spend a um, 15 to 18 minute interview uh, at the combine when you're rolling through players. And, um, you know, that that player says something that just sticks so hard to you as a person, it's something that makes you go back and, and you talk to your wife about it. And, uh, you know, you're like, wow, this is an amazing young guy. It was, it was just a real, real personal moment. The Lions have good guys on their roster. Quinn picked Okuda because he was one of the most talented players in college football last year. When I was at Ohio State, my sophomore year, we were the 75th overall total defense, and then we finished up my junior year as the number one overall defense. So uh, I love to be part of a change. I think that when you put all hands on deck, uh, special things happen. You know, Okuda said last night he was looking forward to some time alone before he went to bed with the person that he loves most in his life, his mom and a private conversation with her upstairs. An emotional conversation with the Lions' newest draft pick, but he also said today multiple times he is ready to get to work and help change this Lions' defense. Guys? Great to see what that young man is going to do on the field later this year. Brad, thank you. Be sure to stay with 7 Action News, your home for the NFL draft. The draft continues here on 7, starting at 7 tonight. Then be sure to stick around for a recap with Brad on 7 Action News at 11.